Hi, my name's Ken Brown and I've held a few putts in my time over the years playing a couple of Ryder Cups. I'm going to give you a few tips that hopefully will help you hold a few more one putts. Covering everything from your setup to your grip, getting that just right and judging the distance right. I guarantee this book helps you hold more putts. <laughs> Well, when you're watching golf on television or you're playing with your members, how do you grip a putter? You see so many different styles of where you can grip a putter. Well, there's a couple of key things that are absolutely vital when you're putting. No matter what style you do, ideally you want your palms facing each other. You want your right palm, if you're a right-hander, facing down the target line, and you want your left palm facing that. So no matter whether you use a conventional grip, an overlap grip, a cross-hand grip, your palms are always facing each other. You see the way Someone does it like this, sort of pencil type grip. But the key factor is to make sure those palms are facing each other. So that when you're putting, they work together, their hands work together. If one hand dominates, then that happens. The club face twists, opens and closes. Also, grip tension is vital. How tight do you grip a putter? Well, I always likened it to perhaps how tight would you grip a bird? If you're holding onto a bird, you don't want to let it escape. You've got to grip it tight enough to do that, but you don't want to squeeze it. So just light enough. So, if you're judging it between 1 and 10, 1 you're almost letting go, 10 is as tight as you possibly can. Between 4 and 5 gives you the best grip pressure. So make sure your palms are facing each other when you're addressing a putt. Make sure you're not gripping it too tight or too lightly, because a, a tight grip you lose all the feel. And then you can get your hands working together. It's very important that the grip stays consistent between the two hands, and then the hands work together, it gives you a nice rhythm to the stroke, and it allows you to deliver that club square more often. So it's as simple as that. Palms, don't grip it too tight, and make sure those hands are working together. And perhaps, you never know, boom, you might nudge a few more putts in.